Good morning guys. So uh, I'm just walking out of my hostel now to the bus stop to catch my bus to the train station where I will take the train to uh, Kunming which is a city in uh, Hunan province and Kunming is uh, the capital I think and that's actually that's my actual first stop in China to travel you know this is just something where I just to get my stuff together so yeah uh, it's going to be my first uh, experience using a Chinese train okay guys I ended up booking a taxi because um, the bus leaves at 6.30 the bus is right there but it leaves at 6.30 and my train is at 7.30 and it is advised that I go at least an hour earlier to the train station costing me 20 yuan which is like 200 rupees so I don't know if it's worth it for the distance I'm going to be covering but uh, I'm desperate to get there really early so I have to spend the money here so this is where we collect the tickets from guys so to collect the ticket you will have to already have a booking made or you'll have to buy it there but uh, buying there like the chance of getting a ticket is very uh, very small because uh, it's a crowd. It's quite crowded here, you know. And the population is so huge. Trains get booked very quickly. So I booked online on China Highlights for like ten, twelve dollars, and they give you a confirmation number. You just need to show the number here with your passport, and you get the printed ticket, which is useful for the train. Then. So you all saw how easy that was, right? So I got my ticket. Now all I'll have to do is get through baggage and security checks and then I get to the platform and wait for my train. So my train leaves at 7.35 and looks like everyone's already lining up to go to the platform now as you can see. So I think uh, maybe I should get going as well. Okay, made it to the platform. So I think mine's coach number two. So uh, it has to be this way, maybe that way. So let's go there. So uh, got a really comfortable seat, and there is AC. But uh, I don't really like the position of the seat, guys, because uh, it's right in front of the toilet and it's in the aisle. So it's not going to be that comfortable because uh, like I don't have the window seat so the window you know I I thought maybe if I get a window seat I can take a couple of good shots but it's fine I guess like the train has stopped and I asked and found out that this is uh, Kunming station so we finally made it to Kunming by train and uh, I'm really really impressed by uh, the timing guys in the e-ticket it said that it will reach at 2 47 p.m. and it is 2 47 p.m. like for an Indian that's like super impressive <laughs> so yeah like I told you guys, the railway station is the best place to, you know, get an idea of how big the Chinese population is. And it's pretty huge, guys. And this is coming from an Indian, by the way. So, guys, I just got off at the station and uh, near the station itself, I'm having lunch. So, these are the options that I'm getting. Obviously, all of this is not vegan, but those parts are. It's tofu, greens, vegetables and all. So, I've taken that with rice and uh, now I'm gonna have my lunch <sighs> vegan lunch guys in China okay guys I'm gonna have the lunch it's a lot like Vietnam rice and vegetables and tofu this is going to be the vegetables and tofu and a bowl of rice and uh, yum chili sauce I mean chili chutney or sauce or whatever. Wow. I'm so hungry guys. I'm really hungry.
it's bland. I see why they've given separate chutney. You're gonna need the chutney. So this is my hostel guys. I booked it on Hostel World and maybe it says it costs like $4 for a room here. Looks really good though. So do you guys see them playing Magyar? I really badly want to play guys. I so badly want to play this but how am I gonna understand this game ever? <laughs> Oh my god, I want to kidnap him so bad. Oh, thing going on here, guys. I don't know what that was guys I felt like a you know I truly felt like a foreigner here 160 is here guys that's the bus I need to go board and let me be quick So there's no bus conductor here. You have to uh, you have to pay two yuan here in the coin holder. So make sure you always have uh, two yuan with you. Guys, this is my Chinese friend Yang Wei, <laughs> and we're going out to check out the city now yeah, and, uh, and biking to the lake. Okay, Yang Wei has ordered something. It's not vegan, but it looks. What is this, Yang Wei? It's kind of mixia, like rice noodles. What is it called in your language? Mixia. Mixia? Yeah, mixia. Okay. I mean, it's a very traditional food in Yunnan province. Uh, in Yunnan? In this province. In this Very province. Local, local. Yeah, you can have it. Yes. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Whoa. Watch out. This is fun, but also a little scary considering there's so many vehicles. Wow. Are you speaking Hindi? Speaking Hindi? Ni hao! <laughs> Namaste! Namaste in India! <laughs> Me and my boyfriend always travel to Yeah, like so beautiful though. Yeah, it's really good. Yeah. Let's 
So we saw the lake and I'm just chilling here. We're walking back now. What do you think, Yangwe? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, just back to home. Wow, look here, nice, the nice really place. nice traditional looking building. Actually just commercial street. Commercial, yeah. Yeah. China mm. is commercial. Yeah. We buy things from your country, you know Except that? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know we buy Chinese things a lot in yeah. India. Yeah. You're getting our money. <laughs> <laughs> Come here <laughs> to improve Chinese economic. <laughs> Good morning, guys. So, uh, actually, after we got back home, we were just talking and talking and talking, and uh, I kind of completely forgot about the walk. And uh, I'm still staying here in Yangwei's apartment. And um, this is the view from this building. Oh my god. Damn. So okay, this is a moon cake. Yeah, moon cake. Oh, whoa. what's that? <laughs> yeah, oh, looks no, destroy it. Come yeah, on. Destroy. So this, uh, you have this in. It's for the mid autumn Chinese festival. Yeah, it's uh, all of China. <laughs> this is the cute couple that's hosting <laughs> me. <laughs> yeah. Festival uh, in September the thirteenth uh, this year. Nice, so delicious, guys. What is this called? I gave the egg to Yang Wei by the way. Fang Fang, Fang Fang, Fang Fang. Wow! And you put it in the bowl and mix it. Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! Yeah, so going to the market to get some grocery, and I'm hoping to cook uh, some Indian food yeah. for uh, Yang Wei and Stefan. Actually, uh, Stefan ate. Oh, Stefan ate. But okay. it's okay, you can eat a little bit. Yeah, I can taste a little Indian food. But if I don't find Indian grocery, then I'm just getting tofu and cooking for myself. <laughs> okay, we reached the supermarket. The tofu is there. Where's the tofu? You want tofu? Yeah. Oh, it's there? This was a swan. So we're just buying some tofu. I don't think I can cook anything Indian for him because I'm not finding any like Indian ingredients. They all look very foreign to me. Uh, so I'm just gonna, you know, make improvise and make something. Okay, got some tofu. Gonna chop it up. Oh no. Okay, tofu. There was another hard tofu. I don't know. It looked weird, but I should probably try cooking this. It is tofu, right? Yeah. Doesn't taste like it, doesn't smell like meat. I'm trying to do the Vietnamese style, you know, the fried tofu. The one I used to have a lot in Khao Bang in Vietnam. I'm trying to do that. Okay, my skills. Are you excited to try it, Yang Wei? Yes. Okay, I just put some random sweet, sour and spicy ingredients and now we mix them. Sort of like Indian cooking guys. I should have my own cooking show for sure. What do you think? Mmm, that's really okay. Okay? Mm. It's good? Yeah. My turn to try it now. I'm impressed. Good stuff. <laughs> what, what are we playing? Shithead? Oh my god, I swear. Yeah, already. <laughs> I can't even say asshole, wow. <laughs> my videos are demonetized, nice. Shithead time. Oh, you shuffle like a pro. Wait, shuffle. Ah, uh, didn't.